make a joyful noise to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come into his presence with singing. Would you join us in singing, O beautiful, spacious skies, America the beautiful. <laughs>
Seek good and not evil that you may live. Hate evil and love good and establish justice in the gate. Let justice roll down like waters and righteousness like an ever-flowing stream. Receive these prayers from our flawed, vulnerable, yet gifted lives, O God, that from your purposes we may continually be keepers of the lighthouse light to assist safe passage for all on life's journey during night and day, whether by sea, land, or air, or hardly traveling at all. From your purposes, may we continually be sharers of love with each other, from the dignity of which you are eternally the source. From your purposes, may we continually be exemplars of respect for honoring each person as prophets have advocated consistent with your holy yearnings for your people. of the earth will reply to the sovereign, Lord, when was it that we saw you hungry and gave you food, or thirsty and gave you something to drink? And when was it when we saw you a stranger and welcomed you, or naked and gave you clothing? And when was it that we saw you sick or in prison and visited you? And the sovereign will answer them, Truly, I tell you, 
just as you did it for one of the least of these, who are members of my family, you also did it for me. And when you did not do it for the least, you did not do for me. Receive these prayers from our flawed, vulnerable, yet gifted lives, O God, that from your purposes we may continually be detectives of injustice where inequities stifle, where self-interests multiply, where power suppresses and dominates. From your purposes may we continually be conduits of courage to overcome corrosive threats and evolved challenges. From your purposes may we continually be repairers of the breach, where aggression, apathy, and cowardice weaken defenses of the good which you proclaimed at the beginning of the cosmos.
Lord God has told you, O mortal, what is good? And what does the Lord require of you but to do justice, to love kindness, and to walk humbly with your God? Receive these prayers from our flawed, vulnerable, yet gifted lives, O God, that from your purposes we may continually be partners for honoring all persons and creation through science, public service, education, religion, work, art, and economics. From your purposes, may we continually be stewards of democracy to perpetuate, even with sacrifice, the blessings of liberty for generations on end. From your purposes, may we continually be sisters and brothers, colleagues and friends, transformed by grace every hour of every day. Amen. Woody Guthrie's 1940 folk song, This Land is Your Land, has been performed by many artists. In a 1976 concert at the University of Tulsa, Pete Seeger told his audience of an event eight years earlier. He said, back in 1968 at the Poor People's Campaign in Washington, D.C., I was singing this song with my African-American brother, Jimmy Collier. Soon after we began, Henry Crowdog, a leader of the Sioux Nation, walked to the center of the stage and he leaned into Jimmy's microphone and said, both of you guys are wrong. This land belongs to me. Seeger says that Jimmy Collier paused and very considerately replied, well, maybe we shouldn't be singing this song. There was another pause and Mr. Crow Dog spoke into the microphone again. You know, if we're here together to get something done, let's all sing it. And they did. David has provided us with a medley arrangement of This Land is Your Land, Lift Every Voice and Sing, and God Bless America. Let us follow the wisdom of Henry Crow Dog from 1968. If we're here together to get something done, let's all sing. This land is
And now may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. Amen.